Hi everyone, we're here at John Sadler's Auto Repair, and today we're doing an oil service on a 2002 Pontiac Grand Prix with a 3.8 liter. And I always take the radiator cap off because I don't trust just the coolant reservoir to see how much coolant's in the whole system. And what I found out is, I looked inside of here and it looked real dark inside there. Then it has a hose that comes off of it that runs along here and it goes to the radiator and it's your overflow and then it's all soggy. So when I remove the cap off the radiator, it's got a bunch of engine oil on it. <laughs> and what had happened is somebody put, the cap's supposed to look like this. And what had happened is someone poured engine oil into the coolant recovery tank. So fortunately, it didn't get inside the radiator itself very much. Um, you can still see where it's orange coolant down inside the radiator. So I'm just going to clean the neck up. I have a new cap and then I'm going to take this coolant recovery tank off. It just has a couple of nuts that hold it on here, lift it out of the way, put a new hose on here of course, and uh, wash this out with some brake cleaner and get all the engine oil out of it. So, and this is the kind of coolant it takes. It's next cool coolant and you can buy some that's already 50-50 mixed nowadays. Um, and I just mix this with distilled water. So, just a little tip from John Sadler's. When you're doing an oil change, uh, a lot of places today, they'll just check the oil in the filter, or change oil and filter. They won't check a lot of other things and send you down the road. Well, somebody got pretty excited and poured engine oil in the recovery bottle. So, when I took the radiator cap off to look in the radiator, which is a good idea when the engine's cold, just to, just to know, because sometimes the recovery system won't work and the radiator can have to be quite a bit low. So we're going to put a new cap, clean that all up. We're going to have another happy customer at John Sadler's. Have a great day, everyone.